Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Hero, and welcome to Night Security, which is a Japanese horror game by creator Chillo's Art, where you work as a security guard in an office building, and we all know how things go for security guards in horror games. That is a impressive set you got there, my friend. Happy birthday, <laughs> Chillo's calendar. raining. That's food. So what's going on over here? Is this our set? Do we have a kid? No, actually, no. We may have a family. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's someone's... Seventh birthday. They got chinchilla on their cake. Well, that's the mascot of the developer, but still. It's kind of clicking in to things. That's kind of new for uh, Chill's art, where it just holds on the thing if you click in it. Waking up now. So this is night security, so I guess we're... While the family's asleep, we put on our suit and we go out to, uh, work. Oh, you got a chinchilla, uh, doll and one big bear. Yeah, so we only could leave once we had greeted the, uh, the family. Well... Basically said goodbye. October 22nd, security guard, age 35. Hello. Person. What time is it? The hands of clock point to uh midnight. Looks like some people are still here. For now I should go around and lock the door, starting from the first floor. I lost contact of Kago, who used to be secure. Security guard for this building. He probably quit. I'm going to rely on you from now on. This company apparently has a rule prohibiting any overtime work past midnight. Check the clock surveillance monitor and security details before you make your rounds. Wow, there's a lot of noise. Check the fire alarms in the back of the rooms and lock the doors. Turn off the lights in the bathrooms. If people are still present, send them home. Check this door real quick. Anime. You know, people get upset when I do that. I've, I've literally done that since, I don't know, early 2000s. Hey, you, get out of here. Oh, you're the new security guard. Is it time already? 
I guess I'll force the rest of my subordinates tomorrow. So yeah, that's the corporate way. Oh. Finding all these VTubers. I'm just clicking because I thought they were money. Okay, that room's clear. Gotta shut the lights off in the bathroom. Oh yeah, I forgot to do this thing. No abnormality. Then we go and lock it. The locking mechanic's a little interesting. I'm wondering if that's gonna come up. in a uh, more defensive survival way. It's all good. Lock this one? No. Right? Because notice how that room was connected to the other one? There could be a scenario where you lock some of the doors I think that means we're done. Let me just double check if it wasn't like a doorbell or something. Yeah, we're good. Um, and then you gotta like slip through to the other one, right? Anything going on here? It's kind of spooky. Said I understood that about looking at the subtitles. Okay, fire alarm's fine. That's a kind of curious thing, though. What was that about? That. While I'm here, I'm gonna turn the lights off in these bathrooms. Let's give me a jump scare behind me one of these days. And I will not be. Well, this time it's in the front. What? Who? What do you want? Oh, the security guard? Can you please leave the lights on? I'll turn them off. No. Nope. Damn. I'll be back. I can see it from here, you know. person here. Cat. Meow. Heh. <laughs> That's Ronald McDonald. What is it? Oh, are you perhaps... Hmm. You're cool. Let's exchange contact information. Wait, what? 
I can't leave unless you give me your contact information. I promise you won't regret it. Hehe, <laughs> you better not ignore me. Goodbye. What the hell? I'm just a security guard. That's starting to hurt my eyes. I'm gonna stop doing picking those up. I did get the... Yeah, I did. You didn't turn the lights off. You better get that done or I'm in trouble. Okay. Isn't there one of those TVs? Weird. Interesting. There's like a type of writer or something. Uh, I think consistently in all of them. Look at that. Hey, where are you going? Who's that person? Why'd you turn the lights off? Didn't ask you to leave them on? Wait. Wait, what? I'm on a different floor. What are you doing on this floor? Wait, what? Um... What is going on over there? Things are getting weird, Kyodai. No, I'm not... He... Weird. We're done here. It's like a bathroom ghost. Don't pay me enough for this. Fourth floor, which is terrible and unlucky, and there's paper being printed on its own. I'm just a hard-working man with a family. I just want to go back to my kid's birthday. Can I help you? It's you again. My boss wants me to finish his work by tomorrow morning. There's no way I can finish all this. I never thought being a working adult would be this tough. Yeah, okay, get harder. They even told me to clock out on time. 
They've got to be kidding me. You're the only one who knows how hard I work overtime every day. Seeing you boost my mood because it means I can go home. Sorry, I guess I'm going home. See you tomorrow. Later. Things malfunction in these places. I shouldn't be too worried. Okay, it's good. Hi. Oh, God. To place the board, where would I get more bolts? So, anyway, we can confirm the one girl walking around is a ghost. Oh, I don't like the layout in this room. Hug the wall. One down. That's where the bulbs are. Two down. So far, so good. I have this bathroom to go into, too. Do you hear words scary noises? Fantastic! Get off this floor. I'm curious if the whole game's gonna resolve in one night. Or if it's a multi-nighter. Floor number five. It's a little dark in this floor. Let's go check the electrical room. A little dark. It's, it's all the dark. It even look like an office room. Looks like I'm in like some kind of Dark Souls cave. The fuse is missing. Pretty soon my life is going to be missing. What single glowing red room? Let's turn the lights on first. Never one buzz. Looks like there's no power. Let's find the reason. Because the fuse is missing. Yes.
Go right. Right is always right. We're still technically going right, by the way. It's like a rule of mazes, like you hug a wall and just follow it. Secure card, you ever think of quitting? I feel like going to like a blood maze, this might be over your, uh, your pay grade. In a fuse. Let's get moving. We're not safe here. We are not safe here. Very bad, not good. Not good. For people who have bad contrast or YouTube compression, there was something around the corner at the end. What's splashing behind me? Whoa, woman! Scariest thing in the world. There you are. The lights haven't turned on yet, so can you go flip for the circuit breakers? Me? I'm leaving. Good luck with your job. She leaves, she like walks right through a wall. I'm following, I don't trust you. Two. Triple. Check out these quads. The person from earlier must have left. I'll confirm in the surveillance room on this floor. We have a surveillance room on this floor? Aren't you more concerned about the blood hallway? You just don't care? I think that's normal. Oh yeah. Surveillance room. I'll close that. That moment was caught on the surveillance cameras. In a place like this, I can't believe she's... I'm quitting this job. So you definitely are related to the ghost. Fifth floor. The boy was a security guard, right? Oh yeah. 
He's pretty good looking, so I made him mine. Eh, but... Wasn't he dating her before? You know, everyone knows that, well, except for that power... What? Because he took him by force. Don't boy say it, well, basically went him over my body. Serious? Maji did. Anyway, she was no match for me. I'm more charming than so was don't you think? You're a real devil. What are more popular when they're a little devilish? Huh? What happened? Dead. Ha <laughs> ha That's that rod animation. Hey, you left your friend. Didn't I lock all those? Oh. Oops. Where am I on the fifth floor? That's behind me. Hmm. Hmm. There's nothing there. Oh boy. Ghost! I think we need to go clean up the third, uh... floor. Something was following me. It's locked. Hey, wait a minute. That work? Ha <laughs> ha! No, it didn't. Just close the door. That's not a bad thing. Oh God. Are you normal? What is... what is going on? You don't do anything, apparently. Our security guard is... They got have, like, done, like, a run at, like, Freddy's place or something. They're just so used to this, they just don't even, like... Eh, I'll blood on the floor. Janitor will take care of it. No abnormality. Just, you know, a chair maze. That's normal. It's fine. Can I help you? Good for you.
Man, sucks for them, huh? I'll let you do your job. How many floors? I guess the game's gonna end at floor 11. I, I don't think we're gonna like leave. The switch is missing. Might be nearby. Let's look for it. This game kind of reminds me of that Gary's mod thing with the elevator. Yeah, see, just, things just keep getting weirder. And our protag doesn't care. Climb. Oh, this is a good setup. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, I see you down there. Gone. Hi, buddy. Is that for me? Thanks. You're lucky I'm, like, immune to, like, creepy dolls. I see you guys as just friends nowadays. Y'all need a friend. Even a creepy doll can be a friend. That's not me. That's not me. Hey buddy, uh, any buttons up there? do. Oh, that's strange. You know, I'm actually uh, really digging this one. I think this is actually one of, uh, it's one of Chilla's Art's best games yet. Like, it's, it's just, it's not typical whatsoever. Okay, I turned the lights off. I don't think there's any doors to lock. Jump scare. I don't, I don't really see lights or a switch. So, like, do I just fix the buttons and call on a day and my job is done? I'll be seeing you guys later. It was fun. Thanks for finding the buttons for me. Whoa! That one wanted to eat me. You know, I like that guy. That guy's name's Mark. the can. What was 
ね。It's very bad, not good. Very bad, not good. Big office in this one. Be a little bit careful. Could be, uh, rabbits around here. I've seen what they can do. So far, no thing of, uh, Real note going down. For a can. Maybe we're getting like a little breather, you know what I mean? Relax a little. Yeah. Relax a little. Slowly security guard. Doing his job. <laughs> it's not my fault I couldn't do anything. Because they died. Everyone disappeared because of them. I didn't do anything wrong. Everything is their fault. <laughs> Whoop. So long, farewell! That wasn't too bad. Chair. Gotta think about how I'm tackling this. Start from the right. Get over with. Two bathrooms last. Remember. It's locked. I have nothing to do with this. You are grudges with the women, not me. You already ate one of them. Nothing to do with this. Oh. <gasps> Let's just get this over and get out of here. We're fine. We locked the doors. Ghosts can't go for locked doors. It's against the rules. You okay? Yeah, they are. 
Are you doing push-ups? Yeah? Crap, I fell asleep. It's already this late. What's up with you? You keep coming over and over again. You're staying there every time I wake up. Are you here the whole time? Oh god, it's loop. Whatever, do you know where my boss is? It may not be a little loop. It's probably like a, uh... Reality marble. Did you leave already? It's it's how he's perceiving things. That damn power ass was that he wouldn't leave until everyone else did. I'm leaving too. Don't die to the ghost. She eats people. Except me. I'm totally gonna survive. I gotta clean these damn bathrooms. I don't hear the, like, the little dings. I did everything. What's left? I'll go upstairs for the emergency exit. Was this here before? Security guard, you gotta stop going for ghost mazes. Oh no. It begins! We need to go now. Now. We need to go now. Now. Friendly. You're not attacking me. Hey, you wouldn't have to know a way that doesn't involve passing through you, right? And getting torn to shreds. See, I told you she's friendly. This doesn't involve us. She's already got her revenge. If anything, she's slightly attractive. Unironically. Can't go down. No stairs. This is fine. Oh, yeah, I gotta lock it. Still got a job to do, you know.
I'm wondering where the ending determination is going to be in. I haven't quite seen it yet. Maybe it's like not doing her job properly. Or the opposite. Does this elevator work? It does. Taking a while though. All right, floor 11, last one. Uh, I think you're sending me to floor hell. Oh. That's a little bit of a bug. You seem familiar. We're leaving. Oh yes, the final floor. Time to do my job. You know somehow things are less scary when there's blood everywhere? You know what I mean, right? Because blood is kind of like... It's kind of like mortal. Alright, it's checked. I don't think I actually have to check it. If I don't even have the option like locking doors. Oh, there's something here. You okay? Nope. I'll check that out in a second. I'm gonna check the bathrooms out. Awful. Terrible. Yeah, yeah, put the cable in. It looks like that's gonna be determining our fate right there. Nothing is displaying. Need a VHS tape or something? Taking a bloodstained lid. I think I should be able to clean this stain. Zero, three, six, nine? I mean, it's just a clock, but that may be a hint that we need for something. I watched the blood off the lid. There are two lines drawn on it. Ninety sixty. Okay, sixty ninety. Your tape. This will go well.
God, that noise. Can't quite figure out what's going on. Something happened. That's definitely like a crime scene kind of tape. I st I can't stay here anymore. Let's get out of here. You leave. She's coming, she's coming, she's coming, she's coming, 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 coming. I'm thinking that's a bad ending, so don't go down the stairs. You know, it's how it's rewinding. Remember I mentioned the loop thing? I don't think it's like a hard loop. As in, like, we were already dead. I think we'll see that in the good ending. I think it's a... Until you escape, you're trapped. Kind of thing. I think this is the first time Chill's Art's done, like, a... Unique credit sequence like this. This is pretty different. Like, it, it's rewinding for the entire game. That's why I want to get you to stick for the, uh, the Patreon rewards. Almost made it there? No, so that's quite the way these go, actually. All the way back to the apartment.
I'm not playing this, by the way. This is still part of the ending. Ending one. Yeah, please rewind. Be kind. So what happens if you catch me? Uh, let me just send you right back here. Now, I did see something over right here. And it was like the drawing from our fridge. Oh. Interesting. So, hold up. We're gonna lure her into here. Because it's gonna... Kind of, kind of goof her up. We're a lot faster than her. Never would even put in there. Yeah, it ain't working. The age of the uh, family members? I have another idea what it could be. Let's try. It worked, it worked, it worked, it worked. Where do I run? Where do I run? Maybe I, yeah, unlock this. Okay, we're out. Later, loser. Oh, oh, where am I? What happened to me? Life good. Oh no. Ending two. See, now in this credits, there's no uh, looping anymore. No rewinding. Although we do hear a noise. So we'll see. Maybe there's a post credit scene.
So that's it for night security. So I really like this one. So some Chilla's art games are okay. Some are really good. Like, they actually have a really good concept of sometimes setting up atmosphere and horror. Better than some other, like, more developed game de uh, well, indie game developers when it comes to the horror spear anyway. Like, I actually thought some parts of this game were kind of creepy. Like, I was actually taking slow a little bit. Like, I'm not really kind of, like, able to figure out where the thing is going to come from. Where's the hit going to be, you know what I mean? Uh, I did like this one got a little weird at times. There was a bit of a surreal aspect. A lot of Chilla's art games do have that, but this one... First off, it's tight. Sometimes Chilla art has a problem when their games aren't very tight. Sometimes literally, as in, like, you could just wander off the map and just waste your time. But this one's just... It's just hit after hit. Each floor is something a little different and new. That's why I was trying to wonder if it was inspired by some of those old elevator, uh... They had some horror aspects, but they weren't horror games. So I like to mix up, and I like the pacing. And the ghost wasn't too predictable. They didn't just come out and, like, attack us. Nor were they completely harmless. So, like, your brain's kind of, like, wondering, like, where's this ghost on the line here? So I really liked it a lot. I thought it was pretty good. One of their better ones in recent. Storyline-wise, I'm a little bit confused. So, like, and mostly in the aspect of, was the girl, who was the ghost, was she real? And I say this in, was she actually a ghost? Was she a real person that was stalking us? And you know, the whole game was just a dream, quite literally. Because obviously something is weird. Our security guard doesn't question anything. Like, there's this weird stuff going on, and he's just, eh. Or was there appearance at the end that was just the ghost following us? Saying like, oh, you'll never get away from me. When I'm editing and rewatching my playthrough, I might be able to put together the pieces a bit on that. That sometimes happens. But yeah, anyway. So, thank you all for watching play Night Security. I'll see you guys later and take it easy.